Welcome students in my new tutorial based upon MS Word and today's topic is alignment. So what is alignment? So as it's written here, alignment refers to the positioning of the text on a page. So how your text is positioned on the page. For example, this is written define alignment. It's been in the center of the page. So I could say this is center alignment. And where the alignment options are there, that I'll show you. These are the alignments. Wait, I'll show you. So these are the alignments. Okay. First one, uh, first one is uh, left alignment. Second is center alignment. Third one is right alignment. And this is called justify alignment. So firstly, I'll do the practicals and side by side, I'll explain it also. So suppose this text has been written, okay, and now if I'll press this number one alignment, align left, if I'll just press this option, you will see here a whole text is equal from the left side, but it is unequal from the right side. You could see here like this, like this it is, it's something like this, it's not equal, okay. And if I'll use center alignment, but before that I have to select the text. Suppose I have selected the whole text and now I want to use the center alignment. And if I'll do it, you see whole text is coming in the center. Okay. It sets the text in the center of the left and right margins. So this is left margin. This is right margin. The same way I could show it with this text also. Suppose this text, if I'll select and I'll move it towards the left side by pressing align left. So see, this text is moved towards the left side. Now, if I want to move it towards the center, I'll press the center option, center alignment. And then if I move towards the this right side, this also I can do. If I'll press it, my text will go towards the right side. You could see here. Okay. Now this text also I want to move towards the right side. So I'll just select this option. So you could see here whole text is equal from the right side, but it is unequal from left side. See like this. So this is opposite of the left alignment. And the last one is justify alignment. The keyboard shortcuts are also there. So firstly, I'll just select this text, okay? And if I'll press justify alignment, keyboard shortcut is control plus J. You could see here, it's appearing. Distribute your text evenly between the margin. If I'll press this one, you see it distributes. Now from left side also it's equal and right side also it's equal. Just see this line. You could say this text is not because the line is not written that much, your text is not written that much that it should occupy the whole line. But wherever it is taking the space, it will be equal from both the sides. So I hope uh, the whole concept is clear. Align left, keyboard shortcut is control plus L. You could see here. And center, control plus E. And right side, control plus R. If I'll move towards the right side, align right. And for justify, control plus J. So I hope this concept is clear. I'll just make this text again in the center. Along with the alignment, I want to teach you uh, this line and paragraph spacing. This is also very important. Now here I have used two paragraphs. This is paragraph one. This is paragraph two. So I'll select the whole text. You could see here this option. If I select here these options drop down options will come and here are some numbers are written one like this is the space by default it is one if i move it to 1.15 you could see some changes are taking place that means the space between the text vertically is been increasing suppose i select 2.0 if i press this you could see here the space is been increased between the whole text okay control a 
again i'll select this control a means to select whole text uh, in my last tutorial i have already taught you again i'll press line and paragraph spacing option and then i'll make it to 1.0 okay and then there is one two more options add space and remove space line spacing option that i'll be teaching you afterwards add space before paragraph if i'll click it more space will be there before starting of the paragraph this is the paragraph and remove space after paragraph if i'll just press this option so extra space between the paragraphs will be deleted so i hope uh, these options are very much clear to you how to line the text and how to give the vertical space between the text with this short tutorial i am finishing and if you like my explanation do like share and comment and do subscribe my channel if you have not subscribed it earlier okay bye bye take care meet you soon with my next tutorial